Hi guys, Chris here with Super Savvy Travelers. Hey, I'm coming to you from sunny El Dorado Hills, California. Finally, it's sunny. Oh my gosh, it's been cold and mm, bruto lately and I don't like it. So anyway, today is just a breath of fresh air and I wanted to give you an update on our beautiful little olive oil project. Okay, so lots going on. Uh, first of all, we are up to $10,893. Thank you, Luz, for donating. Luz was our most recent donator. We thank you so much for that. Now, because our goal was initially uh, $15,500, you can tell that we are closing in on it very rapidly. So I had a little chat with our mysterious benefactor who has been um, watching everything and, and really contributing to the excitement. Now, instead of using he, she, they for our mysterious benefactor in order to preserve he, she, their identity, I'm just going to say they. Okay, generic they equals uh, mysterious benefactor. So anyway, we were having a little um, chin wag this morning and decided, because I said, look, we're almost up to our goal and you are going to double things. How does that work? I haven't done a lot of fundraisers in my lifetime. Um, what happens when we get close to our goals? And he said, well, I think we should keep matching donations until the end of the year and see how far we get because we want to make sure there's plenty of money in case they run into anything that, that's going to cost more. And we can also use any leftovers to start on phase two. Now, phase two, if you remember from the video, is we're going to get the apartment above or the little unit above and restore that as it was when the mill owner lived there in the 1740s. Now, that to me is even more exciting than the mill. The mill is really cool and I love the mechanics and all the steampunk stuff that's in there. I love that stuff. To me, the life is really, really intriguing. I want to know how they lived. You know, how did they heat their place? What did they eat? Where did they eat? You know, what was life like back in the 1740s in this cute little village? So we're so excited because we're going to be able to give you that, at least a major portion of that, and uh, have a big jump on the fundraising for phase two. So, okay, I'm too excited. I'm too excited because when I start doing that, you can tell I'm getting out of control. Anyway, thank you guys so much for donating everything you've donated. I am going to uh, document the renovations of the mill. We're going to document every single part of it. And I'm just really overwhelmed by the outpouring of support for this beautiful community and this cute little mill and, and us, everything. It's just been so wonderful. So happy Christmas, you guys. We're going to still keep updating. Exciting. Thank you, Mysterious Benefactor. Thank you to everyone who donated. And we'll see you very soon.